Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Glad you could join me this beautiful Tuesday morning. We got a good, definitely beautiful word. And I hope you turn in later, tune in later to Iron Sharp Iron at 7 p.m. We definitely will be diving in a wonderful word. So in this beautiful word, we have a problem out here in the body of Christ. People not being able to differentiate what Jesus is saying. That is because a lot of people are operating in the wrong spirit. What is the fruit of the spirit? A lot of people are running around talking about they have fruit because they have materialism. Jesus is not talking about materialism. Though his father already let us know that the things of this world is not from him, but it's from this world because they do not glorify the spirit. The spirit and materialism have enmity between each other, so it cannot please God. Hallelujah. So when we look at the story, we're going to look at Jesus, how he came down to Jerusalem, to the Pharisees, the tops. Look what he told them. Let's break it down. Starting right here at Matthew 21 at 42 and 43. Jesus said unto them, did you never read in the scripture, the stone which the builders have rejected, the same has become the head of the corner. So the builders were the Pharisees, and they rejected Jesus. But Jesus is letting them know the one that they rejected himself, he has become the head of the corner. Hallelujah. The same has become the head of the corner. This is the Lord's doing, he said, and it is marvelous in our eyes. Therefore say I unto you, the kingdom of God shall be taken from you and given to a nation, bringing forth fruits thereof. So Jesus let these Pharisees know that the kingdom of God is being took from them. Remember, they had it and given to a nation, bringing forth fruit. So this nation is going to be a mixture of people called from the east and the west and the north and the south that who was partaken of the sign of the Holy Ghost who have partooken of Jesus Christ. And they are going to be building in that spirit, Galatians 5.22, the fruits of the spirit, gentleness, meekness, long-suffering. So when these things come in your life, allow it an opportunity that God has given you to work on yourself. When people are getting on our nerves, have patience with them. When people are showing us hostility, be gentle with them. Amen. Hallelujah. I know we might not get it on the first mark, but make it a reminder of yourself that when that situation arises back up, that you allow that work to work in you. You be blessed in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen.